And now it's time for... How do you do that? It's not hard to make a rocket that flies. You'll need cardboard rolls and some extra cardboard. Measuring tools, scissors, pencils and markers, straws, glue, something for a nose cone, tape, and parachute materials, like plastic bags and strings. First, mark four points on the cardboard roll, where you will draw lines for gluing on tail fins. You can use the edge of a door. Mark an extra line between two of the fin lines to attach a straw for launching. Then measure and cut out four tail fins from the extra cardboard. You will also need to cut and roll some cardboard to mount an engine cartridge inside the bottom of the rocket. Attach the engine mount and tail fins with glue and you're ready to paint. Plastic eggshells make good nose cones and they can be attached with a rubber band and some duct tape. Cut up a plastic bag. Reinforce the corners with some tape. And use string to attach a parachute inside the top of the rocket. Put some wadding inside the top of the rocket. Roll up and insert the parachute. Then place the nose cone on top, and you're ready to launch. For this, you'll need the help of an adult. An engine cartridge and ignition wire need to be inserted into the bottom of the rock. Launch along a metal rod inserted through the straw with a battery charge delivered through the cables to the ignition wire. Five, four, three, two, one. Ignition.